Hey everybody, I'm Julia Guglia and we're at Qdoba Mexican Eats. Oh. JP, get out of the road, there's a car coming. Today on Healthy Junk Food, we visit Qdoba in Nanuet, New York, where anything can happen, like this. No, 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 no. Oh God, watch as Julia dances, JP runs into traffic, and we both eat tacos. Lots of tacos. Qdoba invited us to try all six of their knockout tacos. And since this is our first time, we figured we'd make the most of it. JP and I have never been to Qdoba before, and already we're having an amazing experience. These tacos, as far as food goes, look beautiful. Like, I don't even want to eat it. The first taco we tried was called the Drunken Yard Bird, made with tequila lime chicken, guacamole, cilantro, onion, salsa verde, and cotilla cheese. It smells fresh, it looks fresh. All the ingredients on here look so great. It's so good. Oh yeah. We're gonna have to go seconds because I already want more of this. You can taste the lime. The lime is really prominent. Do I feel like I'm drunken? Maybe after three of those. I can't wait to try the next one. The next taco is called the Mad Rancher. Filled with grilled chicken, bacon, hand-smashed guacamole, picante ranch, lettuce, pico de gallo, and cotilla cheese. It's no wonder I have to voice this part over. There's so many things to remember. It's like a chicken bacon ranch taco. You're right, it's like a bacon ranch pizza. The flavor is there. And that's exactly what it is. Take a big bite. If you put guacamole on anything, it's gonna be great. I love the bacon in this. This is delicious. Crazy variety going on. For the third taco, we're going vegetarian with the bohemian veg. Packed with stuff vegetarians like, such as meatless black beans, corn salsa, guacamole, salsa verde, minced onions, cilantro, and cotilla cheese. So I'm not a vegetarian, but I love tarians. What's that mean? I don't know. Oh. I feel good about myself now. I'm eating vegetarian. You can't make fun of vegetarians. I'm not, I'm just kidding, I love you guys. I'm gonna do a bite down tactic, rather the side squeeze it out. <clears throat> I think it's inevitable, there's so much goodness in here. You got a big here. green glob on your face, mm -hmm. it's awesome. Did I get it? Nope. Aww. I win. You taste the freshness of each component. I'm eating vegetarian. You taste the lime, you taste... I'm eating vegetarian. You're not gonna leave hungry. I'm eating vegetarian. Even after eating a vegetarian type of meal. The fourth taco is called the two-timer, made with pulled pork, salsa roja, shredded cheese, lettuce, pico de gallo, and cotilla cheese, and a crispy taco wrapped in a flour tortilla with three cheese queso. Holy mother of this being the best combination ever. Yeehaw! The two-timer. I'm gonna two-time this. The pulled pork. Yeah, this one's really good. Everything's seasoned well. I think I just want more of that hot sauce now that I'm getting a little bit of it. What do you think about the Roja sauce? Very spicy. It's more like a salsa than just a hot sauce. The bacon ranch is my second favorite now. This is my first favorite. Oh my gosh. Oh no. Don't get full. The fifth taco we tried is called the Triple Threat with grilled adobo marinated steak, bacon, fajita veggies, pico de gallo, and three cheese queso. Seems like you're actually eating a fajita, right? Mm -hmm. I'm gonna eat it from the other side because I see that piece of steak hanging out there and I want it. Steak is tender. Mm. The three cheese queso on that steak with the bacon. Oh my gosh. That is a fresh cut pepper. That is not in a jar, it's not from a can. Three of these is a filling meal. I figure everything would be a filling meal though. Pop, pop, pop. The final knockout taco we tried was called the Gladiator, made with grilled steak, bacon, pico de gallo, lettuce, Mexican Caesar dressing, cilantro, and cotilla cheese. The gladiator. One last bite. Oh, the gladiator. Until we order more from the menu for the health of it. Me hungry. That's really good. The steak with the Caesar dressing, it's like a really nice change. You got a big glob on your face. You got more glob on your face. The gladiator wins the battle, in my opinion. It's my favorite out of all six knockout tacos. Really? Yeah, I didn't even realize it was going to be that good. Fidoba, call me. Open up near me. I will go there every day. You know what? I'm gonna change my mind. The vegetarian option was my favorite. <laughs> so we definitely did some damage on these tacos, but we needed to save room for more food. So Julia got a burrito that she compares the size of this to a baby. Oh my God, this is like a baby. And I got a delicious quesadilla with uh, two pounds of cheese. And there you have it folks, our first trip to Qdoba. Great value, huge variety, and what I liked most was that it was different. Different ingredients, different flavors, and so many different things to try. We met some amazing people, had an amazing time, but we have one last important thing to share.
Leftovers.